Oh, Danny boy, how you doing there, down there in the beautiful red centre? And welcome to all the Galactic Federation All-Stars uh, roaming around this planet trying to bring peace and uh, security and everything else, including devil dabbling uh, to this wonderful Earth. It is the very first day of 2008 and how good does it be? How good does it feel to be alive? Alive and walking with a pulse. Um, we're going to cut down very shortly to Danny Boy um, at Earth Sanctuary World Nature Centre in the sandy red, red desert. You're on board Earth One. This is the Druid ship and uh, we're uh, roaming out in space trying to uh, keep you guys up to date with these climate changes as uh, as uh, some uh, some parts of the earth reach a dismal end others are on an upward spiral so before uh, we uh, carry on anymore we're going to cut down to the beautiful uh, earth sanctuary world nature center and uh, see what danny was doing a little earlier on so uh, let's get stuck into that see you guys in a moment Yeah, g'day Tommy, how you doing up there? It'd be nice to be seeing the, uh, the beautiful planet Earth from Earth One doing a magnificent job. Here I am at uh, our playground, uh, Earth Sanctuary World Nature Centre in Alice Springs, Central Australia and I'm just uh, standing outside of our uh, very, very flash in Viralu. The Enviralu has been a, uh, a classic for uh, not just the staff here at Earth Sanctuary but also all our visitors who get to experience what a drop loo is all about. Water consumption, is a, uh, is a major concern for our generation and the generations to come and uh, there just ain't any good reason why you need to be weaning into good clean drinking water. This beautiful system here which has uh, been installed for now about five years at the sanctuary is just an absolute cracker. There she is, the inside, yep you've all seen a toilet before but uh, the remarkable thing about the uh, beautiful Enviralu is the fact that she doesn't obviously use any water. We were going to install a flush noise just for those who missed the flush noise, but essentially she comes into this big bucket and there's a big stink pole up the top there to help remove the smell. But uh, all your matter essentially turns to uh, organic dust, which can be later used for your organic garden. And that's just another magnificent way of saving hundreds of thousands of litres of water per day. Tommy, I'm at Earth Sanctuary. I'll see you back shortly in the middle of the uh, homestead for some tunes. But uh, for now, back to the craft. Danny, that's just fantastic. Uh, it's good to see the sanctuary is going right off there like a frog in a sock or uh, seven... Uh, seven strange grasshoppers going hard at a, uh, an aerobics festival. It's very hard to work out the difference. Danny, we're gonna, uh, now that you wake your way back into the beautiful homestead, let's uh, cut over there to our Earth Sanctuary. And uh, how's it going down there, Danny? Is it all hunky-dory? Ah, uh, you little beauty, Tommy. Can you pick me up over there? Oh, can looking you, good. Can you read my T-shirt? It says, get a dog up ya. No, it doesn't really. I'll get a bit closer for you. How's that one? Let's hug it out. Uh, Happy New Year to all the superstars, legends, walk-ins, crawl-ins, grasshoppers, hippos, elephants around the planet. Good luck to you. There is the planet Earth spinning, spinning, spinning. Isn't that magnificent? And there's the current uh, cloud system around, uh, around the beautiful planet Earth as we speak. It's a uh, brand new year, 2008, and we're counting down the days to 2012. Obviously, I think you can read my t-shirt there. Let's hug it out. How's things going up there, Tommy? All good? Oh, Danny, it's just going fantastic. It is indeed the first day of the year. It's hard not to get excited. You know, I just want to, you know, put fruit down my underpants and wiggle around in the sandpit for a couple of hours and uh, get back into things. But, uh, Danny, it is looking very fine. Is it a warm day? Uh, Tommy, it's always a warm day down here at Earth Sanctuary World Nature Centre. Just jumping onto our millicom.com site as we speak. And uh, for those who want to catch up on uh, further information from around the globe, there are all sorts of categories in which we're uh, dumping down into the system uh, every day. So uh, stay tuned for further information on extraterrestrial activity. And obviously, uh, we, uh, we're happy to sponsor those magnificent organisations around the planet, such as the uh, Disclosure Project um, and uh, a variety of uh, Earth-based uh, organisations which we include in the Environmental Defence Network. People who essentially who give a rat's ass. People who uh, don't mind throwing their weight around to save those beautiful whales in the Australian Whale Sanctuary. And uh, P.S. to all those uh, Japanese whaling ships you can go get because we've had enough of your crap in our waters. 
keep touching our whales. I think we'll start throwing our Japanese equipment to shove it up your bum. Anyway, uh, so it is all going well, Tommy. So uh, there's some ET news there and there's some climate change information for uh, the superstars to keep track of what's going on on the big blue planet of Earth. So uh, are you going to come down shortly and have a tune? Uh, yeah, absolutely, Danny. Without further ado, we're going to, going to uh, cross uh, very lightly to some of the activities which occurred uh, on that very transmission for the first day of 2008. There was a bit of activity from the SFYC team in the big rubber dub tub at Earth Sanctuary. So let's uh, have a bit of a look at that and uh, see what you think, and then we're going to get back for MILK and play some Angel. So what's going on here, Tommy? Uh, it's an ancient game, Danny. It's an ancient game that's gone on for many thousands of years, uh, involving a, uh, a hose and uh, a lot of water and um, uh, and a pool which is uh, very organic. And uh, we, I think we're playing it quite well at this point. It is, it is very organic. Uh, I was surprised to know that the cure for cancer might be in our water. Uh, that's very true, Danny. It's uh, looking very stylish. Very stylish. <laughs> Uh, that's very true, but that's uh, we had a couple of our uh, superstars from SFYC around in that day, and I think that what's that music in the background, Tommy? It sounds like a bit of Xavier Rudd. Danny, that that is the very one and only Xavier Rudd, another Australian superstar, comes from down the uh, down the uh, coastal parts of Victoria. Coastal parts of Victoria. Well, they're the coastal parts of Victoria, and uh, he's a bit of a champion, Xavier Rudd, another man who gives a uh, a rat's bottom about another the earth. Another superstar, Danny, indeed. And uh, let's, uh, before we uh, keep more with the uh, technology here, uh, I'm going to uh, get my spaceship sorted out and uh, maybe uh, join you down there for a bit of MILK Angel, Danny. Let's uh, give it a bit of a crack and uh, round up this beautiful first day of the year into some fashionable high frequency style. Ah, uh, well. I think that's probably a very good idea and, uh, and obviously don't forget to uh, throw the, uh, the drum tracks on from uh, your neck of the woods as Earth One is controlling our music from up there, so uh, bang that in. But while we do wait and we put the drum tracks in there for uh, another M.I.L.K. magnificent mega mix, this one's called Angel. It's a bit of, a, uh, it's a bit of an old one for uh, M.I.L.K., but before we do... I'd like to uh, show you the 2012 transition page uh, which was put up on the site just a few days ago for those people who'd like to know a little bit more about the, uh, the ancient knowledge of 2012. And uh, there is a, it's a special date for many cultures around the planet Earth and uh, as this uh, project of ours, Project Blue Star, is counting down the days to 2012, there is also a countdown there just to remind you that we do in fact have uh, just over four years and uh, 11 months to go before we can wind down and see what dramatic transitions occur around the planet Earth as we uh, change our frequency from three to four to five. It's all good. Tommy. Hey, Danny, how geez, you doing? That was nice and quick. It's great it's to be here. Any uh, air traffic on the way? No air traffic. There's a couple of Arcturians flying around doing uh, aerial graffiti. But they're doing it for the love of the planet. Ah, uh, they're the love of the planet. It is all fun and games until you get smacked in the eye. Anyway, superstars, this is uh, Angel. <laughs> 